we go and vote in the midterm election in November, we shouldn't just look at a person's views based on their allegiance to one party or another. We need to look at what are the unintended consequences that many policies politically have emerged. I'm just going to give a quick example. When I mentioned that the Affordable Care Act had negative repercussions, that was probably not the intent of the Obama administration. What happened was when the Affordable Care Act mandated that people pay a penalty for being uninsured, what was not anticipated is that a lot of families of kids with autism are actually uninsured because many health insurance policies do not cover the essential therapies or treatments that kids with autism need. So you have middle class and wealthy uninsured families, dis uninsured families with autism, they're uninsured because they had to pay out of pocket for their kids' mm -hmm. therapies. And now the Affordable Care Act is saying because you're insured, you have to pay this penalty. And these families were unfairly targeted and, and had to pay this penalty when they already were struggling financially paying these out-of-pocket treatments. Well, I think, you know, I think you should run for office. Yeah. I think you would be a perfect candidate. So, uh, we yeah. have only a little bit of time, but yeah. you would be the type of candidate that you would be advocate for to for autistic children, autistic adults. I mean, you would be terrific, James. I think, I hope you're thinking about it someday yeah. because we need people like you. We need people that think about other people, people that experience them themselves. Yeah. Uh, and you, you really need to be an advocate. You have to be there. F and, and I know you go around and you yeah. lecture. And I hope that you're getting through to some of these candidates on both sides, you know, yeah. Republicans, Democrats, Libertarian, Pam, every candidate there is, and you need to show them and tell them what, you know, people with autistic people and people living with autism, what it's really about. And I want to thank you. I want to invite you again to come and be a guest of my show because we just hit, we're just slightly hit a lot of things that we need to yeah. be done on this show on autism. Again, thank you very much for being here. And I hope that in this program will improve the lives of people, will help them understand there's, there's many different things that they can do. There's societies. Uh, I think Autism National, uh, uh, the Autism Society, yeah. is there, there's another one? Absolutely. And I'm just going to close basically by, by saying, know the unintended consequences of what you're supporting.